The most recent short that I did was for my slinky escalator and I barely got it down to one minute but just before publishing it I did one more tweak and I screwed up. It ended up being just a fraction over one minute long. I thought it was odd that on the uh, videos page it showed up as one minute and one second long although on the view page it's only one minute long. But then I was starting to see comments that the video wasn't showing up as a shorts video and looking into things, sure enough, it was presented as a regular video. But by that time it was too late to just re-upload it because enough people had seen it already. If I re-uploaded it, people wouldn't re-watch it and the algorithm would say it must be a sucky video and the whole thing would be jinxed. So I just left it the way it was. But even though it was meant to be a short, it did quite well as a regular video. It got 91,000 views on the first day and then settled in at maybe 140,000 views, but then later it got a surge and it did quite well. It ended up earning over $1,500 in ad revenue. And now compare that to my most successful short, the uh, Burning Sawdust in a Wood Stove video. That one got over one and a half million views and it earned $123. But looking at when it made that money, let's click on the revenue graph. And you can see most of that money was earned in the initial few days before it actually got most of the views. That's because back then shorts showed up in the regular viewer on desktop so it made regular ad revenue. That doesn't happen anymore. Here's illustrating this again. My chisel holder view made $160 on 224,000 views. But if you look on here, here's the initial surge of views and then later, this is just from the shorts, it got another surge. But if we look at the revenue graph, that little bump here doesn't even show up because the short shelf just doesn't earn you money. So again, this one earned most of its money off of the regular audience. Nowadays, even on desktop, shorts show up in the shorts viewer, which I really, really find annoying. And it also doesn't show ads, so you don't have the opportunity to make a regular ad revenue on those. Of course, you do get some money out of the shorts fund if you have enough videos on your shorts but that turns out to be somewhere around 10 cents per thousand views that you get. So unless you're getting hundreds of thousands of views on your shorts, it's hardly worthwhile. So I got to like shorts for the idea of just re-editing and reissuing some of my older videos as a really short video, but I'm coming less and less enamored with the idea of shorts. So this one video here where I actually failed to make it a short because it was six frames too long, it actually did way better, at least in terms of ad revenue, than it would have been if it had been a short. Sure, it might have gotten a million views on the short shelf, but <laughs> it might have made $100 that way, whereas this video went on to make $1,500 and got 700,000 views, so that's way better. That's actually way more money than I've earned on all my other shorts together.